Alabama's weather on this Independence Day featuring the typical hit and miss showers and storms. That is a live look at the Interstate 65 59 20 junction in downtown Birmingham. Rain is falling there, but for some of you, not a drop of rain today. That's the way it goes on these summer afternoons. Here's the radar and really north of Birmingham. Things are relatively quiet today, although showers are beginning to form there and understand any spot could see a shower between now and about 10 o'clock tonight. You can see those showers here very close to downtown Birmingham, just north and west of downtown. Heavier showers and thunderstorms in parts of West Alabama, parts of Fayette and Tuscaloosa counties. These are not moving much. They are featuring a lot of thunder and lightning. In fact, 41 lightning strikes here in the sector for the past. 10 minutes. Some of the heaviest rain is falling through parts of Sumter and Green counties pouring now down here below Utah down toward Bology and Interstate 5920 in West Alabama uh, in East Alabama scattered showers in progress in parts of Calhoun, Talladega, Clay, Randolph and Cleburne counties in all of these. Well, I say all most of these not all but most should be over by fireworks time tonight at nine o'clock. Here's a look at temperatures. We've got mostly low 90s. The one exception Demopolis. They've got 77. They've seen heavy rain rain today, uh, but it's 95 up the road in Utah. They probably dropped a lot here in the last 10 minutes because heavy rain is falling near there. 90 in Tuscaloosa, 92 for Birmingham, Anniston, Gadsden, 91 for Sylacauga and Coleman highs will likely stay in the low and mid 90s each day for the rest of this week. Tonight, scattered showers and thunderstorms ending by about 9 to 10 o'clock. Lows tomorrow morning should be in the mid 70s in most locations. Temperatures, well, it's summertime. Highs will likely stay between 90 and 95 each day through the upcoming weekend and into next week. It's just that time of the year. Now, here's some good news. We're in the hurricane season. Hurricane season is June through November. The really big months are August and September, but we can have very meaningful systems in July. But at this point, the entire Atlantic Basin quiet is a mouse that includes the Gulf of Mexico. So if you've got a beach trip coming up this week to places like Gulf Shores, Panama City Beach or Destin, no tropical storm or hurricane worries. But again, the peak of the season still yet to come. Here's a look at our 10 day forecast tomorrow. Partly sunny with a few pop up storms in the afternoon. The better chance of those between about 2 and and 10 p.m. The high close to 93. Exact same formula Wednesday, Thursday, Friday. Chance of any one spot getting wet in the 30% bracket. Coverage could be a little higher this weekend, but the pattern stays the same on Saturday and Sunday with highs in the low 90s. 